Hello and welcome to How to Be Dutch, the quiz. All the questions that should be on the Dutch citizenship exam, according to me, the American Netherlander, who's been here for 25 years. If you're looking for an official guide to Dutch culture, this is not it. If you're looking for one man's completely subjective and utterly biased impression of Dutch culture, then you've come to the right place. Have you ever completed the Dutch citizenship course? Well, it's time for the quiz. And if you've never taken a Dutch citizenship course, it's also time for the quiz. Now, if you don't score well enough, then technically you will have to leave the Netherlands. But don't worry. The questions are so subjective that even most Dutch people won't get them right and they'll be leaving with you. Note, How to Be Dutch is a blatant attempt to take personal experiences and generalize the hell out of them. Are these questions the textbook truth? No. Are they the most recognizable examples I could think of? Yes. And hopefully the funniest as well. How to be Dutch. Sample question. What is the name of this country? A. Holland. B. Nederland. C. The Netherlands. Answer. All of the above. In the Dutch language, the name of the country is Nederland, and in English, it's the Netherlands, but the official tourist website is Holland.com. Their ad campaign for years was Holland the Original Cool, and the National Airlines in-flight magazine is the Holland Herald. Now, oddly, of the 12 Dutch provinces, only two have Holland in the title. This may help explain the result of so many Dutch World Cup football teams. Yes, there are legions of orange-clad fans in the stands, but they yell, Holland! Holland! And when the ball goes to the guy from, say, Friesland, a part of him must think, I'm not from Holland. And he misses. Now, maybe the title, The Netherlands, it's just too long, or clunky, or not great for marketing. But then came a little viral video called Netherlands Second, which turned out to be pretty good advertising for this country's true name. And soon after that came the Netherlands, winning Eurovision. Not Holland, but the Netherlands. And now, for the first time in at least 25 years, the Dutch government is ditching the term Holland from all official correspondence and rebranding as the Netherlands. You're welcome. Up next is How to Be Dutch, Chapter 1, and check out my third book, The American Netherlander, 25 Years of Expat Tales, available internationally.